Do you also want the best FPS in Call of Duty Warzone? Then watch the video to the end, but before. First you need to be up to date, so go here to this page, the link you will find in the description. Now for be up to date on Windows 10, press here on update now. It will download here, press on it, and press on open. Wait a few seconds and this will pop up. I am up to date, but if you are not, follow the steps, and be up to date. Then go here, type graphics, press on graphics settings. First check this to on. Restart your PC after we are done with everything. Then press here on browse. Search where you have your Call of Duty Modern Warfare folder. Double click on it. Right click on Modern Warfare. Press on properties. Go to compatibility. Check disable full screen optimization. Then go here to change high DPI settings. Check this box. Then press OK. Press apply. OK. Then select Modern Warfare. Press here on Add. When you have this here, press on Options. Here check High Performance. Press on Save. Go back here to Settings Home. Go to Gaming. On the Xbox Game Bar, select this to Off. Then on the Game Mode. Select this to On, for the optimization from graphic settings to work. Now open files. Go to documents. Go to Call of Duty Modern Warfare folder. Then players. Double click on ADV options. This page will pop up, here on the video memory scale. Delete what you have here, and type 65. Then here on the renderer worker count, to find this number. You need to go here, right click on the taskbar, press on task manager, Go to Performance, on the CPU, here on the cores you can see the number you need to put in there, not everyone has the same number. Then here on the config cloud storage enabled, type 1. Then press here on File, and press on Save. Now open Blizzard, left click up here on Blizzard, press on Settings. Go to Game Settings. On the Call of Duty Warzone, check additional command line arguments. Type here minus D3D11. This command should optimize the game performance. Press here on Done. And close the page. Go here, type this PC. Right click on it. Press on Properties. Here you have to go to Advanced System Settings. This page will pop up. On the Advanced, under Performance, press on Settings. Here you have to check adjust for best performance. Then press apply. OK. OK again. Close the page. Go here type CMD. Right click on command prompt. And press on run as an administrator. Then this page will pop up. Here you have to paste a command. Copy this command from my description. And just right click and paste it here. Then press enter. And now you have the ultimate performance guide, but to activate it, you need to close the page. Then go here, type choose, press on choose a power plan. Then you have to press on this arrow. Scroll all the way down. Check ultimate performance, and now you have it activated. Now open the game, go here to options. On the keyboard and mouse. Go here to Invert Mouse Look. Select Disabled, Mouse Acceleration. Select Zero, Mouse Filtering. Select Zero, and Mouse Smoothing. Select Disabled, then go up here to General. On the field of view, select 100. Then skip Introduction Movie. Select Enabled. Scroll down to Content Filters. Select this two to Disabled. Then go to FPS Counter. Select Enabled. Server Latency, also enabled, to see here how many FPS you have in the game. 
Then go up here to graphics. On the display mode. Select full screen. Screen refresh rate. Select the maximum you have here. Then custom frame rate limit. Select unlimited. Texture resolution. Select low. Texture filter anisotropic. Select low. Particle quality. Select low. Bullet impacts and sprays. Select disabled. Shadow map resolution. Select normal. Particle lighting. Select low. And if you are using a NVIDIA video card, go here to NVIDIA Reflex Low Latency, for low in PC, select here Enabled Plus Boost. Don't forget to press here on Apply Settings. And that's all you had to do. I hope you found this useful. Don't forget to subscribe. See you in the next episode. Bye. Let me down.